Hello you beautiful people, welcome back to the Hyper Place video. Today we are doing some training and we are training our boy Nagi. Now, a lot of you would have watched the Chiguri video from yesterday and, not Chiguri, the Bashiro video from yesterday and seen that we did hit a 37k Bachira. Now we are going to be working on the Nagi, who I do believe we can get even higher than that. Um, the team I'm going to be using is this team over here. So we are running Kaori Mitoma. Reason is he's got the dribble card in gold and he's got that big technical boost. So if you come in, you can see his technical boost at 12%. Uh, we are using Bachira, who actually has a really big technical boost um, and also has that big you know, dribble card. Uh, Raichi, who doesn't have the dribble card, but does have the technical boost. So again, we are going for Raichi. And lastly, Zantetsu is just there as a filler. You could use Free Asagi in this position. There's a number of characters you can use in this position. I really like the fact that he's boosted and therefore is going in there. Now, the last card we are going to take is the Rio card. Again, I know. Um, just because I think he's just got a good array of like skills here, you know, and if we actually take the stat, you can see that we've got a dribble card and the golden dribble card, which is kind of what we want here. In terms of a support, um, support cards, these are the support cards we're taking. Again, I would be tempted to drop Kutsunagi and bring something like my monster. Um, that could actually be, you know, even better. Um, Maybe we'll do one with my monster and one with Kusanagi and we'll see how that goes. But that's fine. Let's just go with Kusanagi for now and do our first training session. Hopefully we'll be able to hit 40k pretty quickly. All we need is a bit of luck. Big awakenings. I'm going to take the early break. There's no point taking on a powerful opponent. Not this early. Cool. And we will take the dribble training. Cool. Ah, again, we'll go dribble training again. Only 200%. Not great. Not great, but it's something. Right, let's go for some speed, because there is kicking power attached to that. And only the multipliers are really low. We sort of had back-to-back -back really low multipliers. Um, you know what? Okay, fine. Let's go more speed. And that's going to sort of take us out the extreme status. Is this a good one? I don't know. I feel like we've had a lot of gold cards, but not quite the big numbers that we want. Okay, we will take a break here. That's awakening. Let's make this happen now. This is where the run really begins. Now we're going to have back to back big. Wait, what? No. No. We actually got scammed. We genuinely got scammed. Wow. We hit Awakening and then only for it to be taken away from us. Oh, we actually got trolled. We could take this or we could go with the big boost here. At only 160, that's a joke. Okay, the game actually just scammed us. It's fine, it's fine. We're still going to get a really big buggy. 500% on that. And it's a good intel boost as well. We've got SS on the technical already. Let's have a look at our tips. We do need to do a revenue match at some point. I think we take the break here. It was never going to give us awakening again. And it just, it took it away from us. I feel like Gollum. It took it away from us, Precious. Bizarre Awakening. Okay, I'm going to take the Dribble Training because we might not get a gold card next turn, in which case, you know, I can just do the tip. But I do need to think about a Revenue Match. I have to go for a big multiplier here. Risk it. Very rarely will I risk it like that, but listen, that was that was too worth it to not risk it. 
Plus, I could revenue match later. 16.3k. This is already a good start, though. I'd say anything over sort of 15k is a great start. This could have been an even better start. We had Awakening and we hit a Black Cop straight after. And yet, it decided to go, no, you only have Extreme. We've had a good, we've had some good cards, just really low multipliers, where it sort of mattered. Cool. I wonder if we could take on a powerful opponent. No, I don't think that's wise. I'd ideally want a normal opponent. Although, only 160. Yeah, we need, we need to take on two revenue matches. Maybe, maybe we can get with one. Let's set the revenue match here. I think realistically we might need two, unless this is a 300k, in which case, let's see actually. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. 260, that is like on the cusp of needing a second. No, we are going to need a second. It's going to take some big, big, big numbers. And plus anyway, we'll need it for the next round regardless, so... I'll take the dribble here. Regardless, we have to go into a revenue match now. Hopefully we won't see a black card, because that's going to stress me out. No, we have to take the match. The only way that say the only way we get away with that is if we hit a five hundred percent and it's not gonna happen. Plus we still need to take a break with not in a great condition at the moment. Our power looks alright, but our condition doesn't. We're definitely getting good good array of sort of gold cards as well. Overall, the stats are looking absolutely fine. And guys, go onto the Discord, share your Bashiras, and then now you can think about sharing your Nagis. What sort of Nagi are you guys hitting in this, you know, in this time? 120%. Not ideal. I probably shouldn't have taken it, but look, you, when you see the gold card, you just take it. I have to take that. Even at 130%, that's just so worth it. We are going to take the break. That's Awakening. Hopefully this time we actually get to keep the Awakening. My problem is I still have to do another revenue match. Yeah, and this, this is definitely the board I want to be doing the revenue match on. So that I get one big training into like, I don't know, maybe something huge. And then we've got, what, five turns, I think? Or four turns of training to go beyond that. So this is our chance to hit big numbers. Hopefully we can maintain awakened status for four turns. Which I think is asking for a lot, but we'll see. Let's get some technical off uh, Barchida. Fine. The one time I need a big card and it just goes, here's a grey one.
Right, come on. Uh, I will take that. 850% is always quite nice. There's a lot of shooting there. Come on. Let's get like another two, three more big numbers like that. Six fifty. Ooh. Is that good? I mean it, it's it's good for sure, but is it like Good enough. 30k on that Nagi. This is going to bring out to 31. We have what? Is it two more training sessions now? Yeah. Going to need big multipliers, big cards. This is definitely not the run though. This, this is a good run. This is not the run. Like, too much went wrong still. I think we can all agree. Three hundred percent right at the end is quite nice. So, at least we got something right at the end that will give us shot master. And ultimately, this can still be an SS. But I feel like we could do even better. I do feel like we could do better. By the way, for you JP lovers out there, we are going to be doing a second video today, uh, a bit later on, where we're going to be covering a new JP account. So do go and check that out uh, when that comes out. I say we do one more training session. I say we make this a double. I clicked the wrong thing. I don't want to train Kira. I'm going to speed run it. There's going to be less... Well, I don't want to say less talking, but there's going to be less... Um, just less. We're, going to just, we're just going to get through this as quickly as possible. But yeah, there is going to be a second video. Um, it's going to be on the JP server... Um, I do have a new account that's sitting on about 90,000 gems. And we're going to be sort of entering JP as like a new player would say with a, one of those fresh accounts. And seeing what, I guess, what you should be working on, what you should be buying, etc. Um, I've had a lot of people ask me like, what is the best sort of start for JP? Again, these accounts are relatively cheap. They're like three, four dollars. So yeah, for sure. Uh, we'll take the break here. And we will take... I kind of want to take that one. Uh, we'll take that. Ooh, huge 500%. Love it. Love to see it. Dude, that's back-to-back 500%. So we will take that. Okay. 250 is absolutely respectable. This is a this is a decent run so far. As long as we make the tip count, this is a very decent run. Okay, I kind of want to take this here. 180. Right, that's not good. Oh, no, 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 I didn't take the black card.
I got excited with the dribbling card. No, this was such a good run. This was such a good run. Alright, alright. Collect. I need to collect my mentals. I need to collect my mental thoughts. Mistakes happen. This could have been an insane run. It's fine. I don't even need that intelligence. Guys. Oh, you can't be giving me 100%. I really need to take the break. I'm forcing it too much. Oh, this is good. This is really good. Okay, that, that has just saved me from taking a break. Of course, the one time I get extreme, it's decided to... This could have been an insane, like... Oh, we're only on 14k. Where we needed those multipliers, we didn't get them, and I didn't take the black card. That is about as bad as it gets. That is absolutely about as bad as it gets. It was so silly of me. I cannot believe I just didn't pull that off. <sighs> it's alright. Strong. We're gonna have a strong finish to this. So the last run definitely had a better early game, and that's with that, the first game. We the game sort of screwed us over. This time we screwed ourselves over. Um, one day I'm gonna get a very clean run, and it's just gonna be that insane forty k Rio. Uh, not Rio, Nagi. We will be training Rio next, I think. You can't, you can't have Nagi and not have Rio, right? And I actually think training Rio is better and easier. Right, big dribble stats. Only 160%. That is a joke. I'm on extreme. Okay, let's go back to image training. Ooh, should we get exercise machine here? This is probably not the best run, you know that. Like, I'm really trying to get these stats in, but... I'm going to take the revenue match so it's just done and out of the way. k, 250k, something like that, please. Wow, okay, that was a really close match. But 300k is fantastic. Okay, that's good. That's really good. That's performance level 4. Unlocked. Three hundred and fifty percent is really nice. Okay, we're back to winning ways. We got Fantasia, which is great. Fantasia can be leveled up, right? There's higher levels of that. All right, twenty k feels again quite low, but we'll have five turns of training, one of which we're gonna have to take a break. Hopefully, hit awakenings. Maybe back-to-back -back awakenings. Um, and this run can be saved. Okay, I am going to take the break. Because Exercise Machine, on a low status condition, just doesn't feel too great. That's an intelligence boost. Okay, that big multiplier, please. Uh, let's do that one. Ooh, okay. This could be the run saver.
I mean, I, I don't know if it saves the run, but it definitely does good for the run. And we did hit the 2 million, so our tip count is absolutely fine. Only 200%. I am starting to like this now, G. I think the first one we trained was slightly better so far, but this is definitely getting there. I mean, if we can hit 35k back to back, that would be quite nice. And we could at least title the video. We're able to hit 35k comfortably now, but... I'll be honest, if we didn't make those mistakes, this would have comfortably been 35k again. Take the break. No awakening. That's annoying. We've got three hits on the training now. Okay, we'll take that. Just when you need gold cards. Just when you need gold cards. Okay, this is... Winning this probably gets us close to 30. Doesn't get us to 35. But uh, again, I, th I still think we did too much wrong on this run. I'll probably, I'll probably keep training him throughout the day. Um, I mean, I've got to record the other video, but I will probably keep training Nagi throughout the day and be posting something huge later. Only 140%. Then again, it's times three on stats, right? So at 140%, that's actually like just under 450. It's about 420% boost on a gold card. Which you have to kind of respect. It's not the worst. Then you could argue it's on stats that you kind of don't want, but that's fine. Cool. So we do go 30.6, and that's going to be... No. Not bad. Right. This is the end of that. Cool. Right, that is the end of the Nagi video. Boys and girls, that is the Nagi we hit. It wasn't great, but we are going to be doing another one. We're going to do an even better one, I promise. So, I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.